Okay, uh, I went to get my nails done and feet. Went to get a Medi Pedi and a fill, and afterwards decided to go to Tuesday morning, which is in the basement, like most of them are, uh, from where I go to get my nails done. So anyway, I didn't plan on buying anything. I just like going in to see what they have, and of course into buying stuff. So let me show you what I bought. Okay. I had to always go look at the little puppy stuff to see if I see anything. And they have these little um, hooded jackets for uh, puppies. And this one, just $7.99. They said compared to $16.99. And actually, I think like in a Petco or something like that, they probably would be for more like $24.99. But what I like about this, you know, it has this... It's real warm, and so I take the girls walking, and it's going to start being colder in the morning because I have to go early in the morning before work, and so um, it's getting colder. And so I thought these were really cute. I won't put the hood on, probably not going to put the hood, but what I like, they're polo, and what I like about them is a lot of these little things that they have for dogs, little sweaters and stuff, do not have this hole back here. And this is where I pull their harness uh, ring through to hook their um, leash. And some uh, sweaters, I have done this before, bought sweaters, and even at Petco or whatever, and um, end up having to like cut a little hole and stitch it in it. But these have it, you know. So maybe those other sweaters just made for them to wear in the house, but whatever. So it's so cute. And so for, yeah, $7.99 for $8. So I got a red one for my little black and white dog, Oreo. And then they only had the one red uh, in the size that I needed for her. And um, then, so for her sister, who is about this color, Peaches, she's kind of like this color, different shades, kind of like this color, I end up getting a blue. So even though they're girls, I got this one because it's just so cute. And then they have the felt, you know, thing. The little sleeves, so they're not gonna like it, but it's gonna keep them warm because the dogs do get cold as mine do anyway, they be sneezing. So I got that, and then um, I like to wear you know, long um, uh, hooded top myself when I walk them. And I have um, black tights, I have uh, three pair one's all black, and then I have two kind of striped black, white, gray, different tones of gray, and everything. They're okay, but they're not that warm and so they had these Tahari's leggings for $4.99 original price $24 but all they have was medium large so I'm hoping that I will fit this hopefully this will be okay I'm gonna check it out if not I'll take them back but again all they have was a medium large so that's what I got yeah you know sometimes for uh you know, uh, you know, I got the thighs and the hips going on. So sometimes, because uh, I normally I wear a medium, uh, you know, in my uh, clothes, I mostly get uh, mediums and and eight size eight and ten, depending on how the skirt is made. But um, yeah, so but sometimes these things here are just not made for women with thighs and hips. So anyway, we'll see, we'll see. So I got those, and if, and if this works out for me, I'll go back and I'm going to uh, buy at least one more pair. They only had black, okay, Tahari. So that's pretty good. Then I found this scarf by Isaac Oops. Maserati. I really love his stuff. I used to be hooked on watching him on QVC, sometimes just to watch him. <laughs> I wouldn't buy anything. Uh, but, um, yeah, I really like his style and the quality of the, his clothes. Some on QVC, the stuff I think is, unless it's like a clearance or something, it was, you know, pretty expensive. So this is pretty good. Nice, uh, soft, uh, shawl, you know, gray. I can wear the gray side or the black side. You know, it looks pretty good. And this was, how much did I get this for? $9.99. And look at that, compare at $35. So this is a really good deal. So I'm going to get a lot of wear out of this. And probably even wear it when I walk the girls in the morning. Who knows? Okay. And then 
I also I uh, have uh, three nice sweaters that I like to wear to my meetings. They're really nice. And I didn't want to uh, hang them up, you know, because how you get that uh, dent in the shoulder part. And then I didn't want to fold them away in the closet because sometimes out of sight, out of mind, at least when you get old, you, you be forgetting what you have. And so I wanted to hang them up on a hanger, and but uh, I didn't want to hang them up on a flat hanger. But I have, that's what they're on right now because, you know, again, the crease. But this is round, padded and round. What does it say? Thick foam, non-slick coating, holds fabric in place. And it says to use this to wear, hang pants and skirts. But I have um, uh, hangers, stacked hangers, like for, you know, with the clips uh, on them for my pants and for my skirts. And stuff. I but I thought this would be great for my sweater, so I just fold the sweater and lay them across. So I got two. This is four ninety nine for two. I compared at nine ninety nine, and so I got two packs of these. And so here's the other one. So I take care of that, and I think that's going to work really good. And then I've been using. Um, I have large uh, these. Uh, skillet then I have another big uh, nonstick uh, skillet but it's just me and uh, so a lot of, I don't need like for my everyday heating up stuff or, or you know cooking me a, an omelet or a sauteing me some vegetables or something like that I don't need the big old pans that I've been using so I thought this was a nice size pan for my everyday use and it's um uh, what to say? Patent perfect. Fits any hand. Uses uses your thumb. It's supposed to be easier to manage. Uh, uh, has five times longer nonstick performance. Handles high heat. Up safe up to three hundred fifty degrees. Dishwasher and metal utensil scratch resistant. No more scrubbing and or scratching. So that sounds good. And it looks like it has like a a glass lid, but with a rubber the edge of this rubber so I guess that's just like after you cook and you I have to open this up and see but I thought it was um yeah there's a picture of it right there what it looks like the top the lid and this was uh $14.99 compared at $19.99 and it's one of those as seen in on tv type of deals so anyway, we'll, we'll check it out. But yeah, I think, thought this would just be perfect for my everyday use. So I got that. And what else did I get? Oh, okay. I like to wear a lot of black, especially in the winter. And with having two dogs, one's black and white, and the other one, like I said, is like a blonde color. I constantly have stuff all over my clothes from the dogs. So I bought this. It's a four-pack of the... Let me see... So it uh, removes lint, dust, and fuzz. You can use it on your clothes, furniture, car seats is another one and, or more. And so it grabs tough to remove pet hair. Exactly what I need. So anyway, I got It's a five pack. I thought it was a four pack. It's actually five. Yeah, there's the fifth one right there. So I'm going to put a uh, couple in my car and one by my, on my desk and just one cut and the other in the bathroom, whatever. So yeah, it's pretty neat. So I got that, and how much did this cost for five? $9.99. So that's like half price compared to $19.99. Okay, so I got that. And then this, I just always go over to see the uh, room fresheners. And I've never bought this one before, but I just like the way it looks. I think it'll look nice on my entertainment deal um, in the living room where I have my uh, picture frames, different stuff, whatnot and everything and it has a really nice scent but it's a luxury room and linen spray so i can spray my bed linen too with it but i think too the uh the couch in the den where i lay the girls uh with two dogs blanket up there and they and they jump on that couch that's only furniture they're allowed to get on they have their own beds and stuff anyway but they jump up there and uh so this is good to spread you know spray your couches and things so i got that and it was $3.99 compared to $7.99. Okay, and what else? Okay, when I first came in, this caught my eyes. It was on, they had a big table of all this uh, coconut, um, ultra, oh, Uvin, urban 
hydration uh, skincare products. And I have uh, right now the, their, I bought, I'm thinking about it, Marshalls, but it's their butter. And it smells really good and it's real thick and everything. And I have that. So I decided this is just $5.99 for this big bottle compared to $12.99. 32 fluid ounces. So anyway, and I uh, unscrewed it and smelled it. It smells really good. It's not, it doesn't have that, um, how stuff when it sits on the shelf too long. It has that tainted kind of smell to it. it does, it's real fresh. So I said, let me grab this at this price. In fact, I think this may have been the only body wash that was up there. So I snatched this one. Okay. So it's coconut oil. I think, and it's uh, with vanilla abstract. And I meant, they had a lot of these, the uh, sugar scrubs and different um, fragrances, and I meant to get the Vanilla Abstract, but I, because that's what that uh, body wash is, and that's what my, uh, the butter is, but this is actually Pineapple Abstract, but that's okay, and that's for $6.99 compared to $14.99, because what I was going to do is get one of a nice, uh, thick glass jar that has like the glass top with it with the, with the rubber seal though and I was going to mix the uh, body wash and the scrub in that jar and it would just look good setting in the windowsill uh, in my bathroom and I th thought it would smell good but who knows the two of these uh, pineapple and uh, vanilla abstract may smell good we'll see because I'm not going back and get another one of these but anyway I got this one okay and it's supposed to, uh, it says good stuff so let's see what the good stuff means and that's what it has on the on the butter and on the body wash. Protect skin, soften skins, improve signs of aging. Okay. Even skins. <laughs> okay. Okay. So it's supposed to have all natural stuff. Not supposed to have any um parabens or anything. There it is. No bad stuff. No paraben paraben free, gluten free, sulfate free, paraffin free. Mineral oil free and no, what is that? Poly beads. I never heard that before. Okay, so it's supposed to all natural stuff, all their products. So good stuff. And then I had to go look at the spices and I made the mistake. I like these gourmet uh, collection spice blends, but I made a mistake. I seen lemon pepper and it says spice blend. And because it says spice blend, I really should have read. Uh, the label because this would be I figured this would be good to put on my salmon because that's about the only meat I eat anymore it's just salmon I don't eat red meats no chicken or anything like that and also I thought just sprinkle it on um, you know uh, my eggs or something because I do eat uh, dairy products well eggs I don't eat cheese anymore but I'll eat, I have an egg maybe th two or three times a week have an omelet but um this is good. So it's showing the expiration September 3rd. You have to watch for the uh, 2020 because sometimes they don't uh, clear their shelf out correctly. Some of the people that work there, there'd be stuff that'd be expired. Tuesday morning, though, they're supposed to, they're trained to uh, to check when they're uh, checking you out. They're supposed to look and make sure it hasn't expired. Just double checking behind each other. But anyway, what I um, n noticed after I got home is that where does it have it this actually has salt and i try not to get any seasoning with any salt not even sea salt so that's a mistake i got that so anyway and um fine oh and the price on this 3.99 compared to 9.75 so what a deal yeah so i'll just go easy on it yeah, just really try to avoid salt. So anyway, and then finally, I got these batteries because I knew I needed some AAA batteries. I was looking for some AAA batteries the other day, and I ended up taking batteries out of something else to put it in. I think it was a little flashlight or something, a little light that I wanted to use uh, because I was working late and didn't want to have the overhead light on. So I took the batteries, I think, out of a remote <laughs> and put it in it. So uh, when I was getting ready, standing in line, getting ready to check out, I seen they had these AAA batteries and I grabbed it. High energy, long lasting. Got them for $2.99 compared to $4.99. And I did get one more other thing. I think I bought some uh, sweet potato 
chips. And I shouldn't have got those because they had sea salt in them. So anyway, so I bought those and I already taken them out of the bag and put them in a Ziploc and threw the bag away. But, so that's my, that's what I got. So all of this right here came to $105, which isn't bad at all. So, but I didn't plan on it. But anyway, I'm happy with my purchases. Okay.